In this video, I assemble and kid review a classic game from the 99 cent store. Hello everybody, my name is Patrick and this is Dad Life Projects. Today, I'm going to go ahead and assemble a classic tetherball game, it says. Classic backyard game, tetherball. Alright. It says it, it's, it was $5.99 from the 99 cent store. We're going to go ahead and put this together. I'm going to have my kids come out and play and see how durable it is. And see if it's really worth the $5.99. Alright, let's get to work. Alright, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to find an area out here that I could go ahead and, and uh, put the stake in into the ground to make sure that it's uh, nice and solid. If this thing works out and it, you know it, it can hold up to my kids, then later on I'll probably get like a, uh, one of those big uh, umbrella brace, uh, bases that you fill up with water and it keeps for the umbrellas and then we can just move around everywhere. But I'm going to put it in the ground right now. As you can see my grass, my kids have just destroyed it. So I'm not worried about holes. I'm not really worried about anything like that. So let's go ahead and start to assemble it. It doesn't look too hard. Actually, I'm pretty positive it ain't that hard. Oh yeah. Very easy. You got the one stake here? Yes. Where it goes, let's see if I get it right here on the camera, where it goes right into the ground up to here. We'll just You just put it on here like this. And basically that's it. Pretty it's for real little kids, I guess. Let me see. Well, it works. I'll have to get my kids out here to uh, try it out. All right, my kids are gonna try this out, Mac and Judy. So why don't you guys go ahead and play with it like you would regular and see if it uh, holds up to you guys. Okay. Go, ah, Judy. Ah, um, how did I this? Okay. It's dirty. It is, the ball is a little low, but I, could, I don't know how to get it up really any higher once you put it in the ground. So. Watch out, Matt. Watch out. Okay. Let's see. Wow! How do well, you do it? It is a little windy, but... Oh! Careful, son. Careful. Can you do it, Matt? It's moving! Yes. But it is made for three-year-olds and up. So, I guess it ain't made for somebody that as old as I am to be hitting that all. It's moving! Yeah! Go ahead, you guys. Keep playing it. Or I'm gonna say it's like just. Like daddy bear, Judy. Like it's good like for kids daddy? that are three and probably not much. I'd say like up to maybe ten yeah. years old. Like and after that, I think they there, probably right? hit too hard. But I'm not sure. <laughs> Works on their hand and eye coordination there. So, do you guys like it? Yeah. All right, good. We love it. 
So for $5.99, I'd say it's probably a really good value. Throw it, throw it. Throw it. She Whoa. wants the ball. What? She wants yeah. that. She wants to bring it with her. Here, I'll show her. Woo. Go. Throw it. Ready? One, two, three. Woo! Yay! Whoa. Did you hit it? Yeah, I should start this. Yeah. One last thing on that tetherball on the 99 cent store tether ball. After a few hours, the ball did come off the string. There's, the, the string has like a, a little nut at the end, it's inside there. So when my kids were hitting it, it ripped it out of there. So what I did was, I went, I put it all back in there, and I had some shoe goo lying around. I guess any kind of silicone or anything like that, I just had this, and I just, I just put a ton on the very top where the string comes out, and let it dry, and hasn't came out since. So, hopefully that fixed it. So with that, check out my next video on Saturday morning. Also follow me on Instagram and Facebook at Dad Life Project. You can email me at dadlifeprojects at gmail.com. Why don't you go ahead while you're here, check out those two videos right there. Also, hit that subscribe button down below. And remember, any job you do, doesn't matter. You are the project manager. Thank you.